ah of the Lord God be upon you. Oh, Shabakabo, see, he come down a little, little, little side. Yeah. They're not going to be able to touch you anymore. Oh, Shabba, I sense the Lord moving over this airway. Thank you. Uh, signs and wonders under the little, little side. Yeah. And the violent take it back. They suffer, but we take it back by force of simple. And we're not sitting down no more under the little, little, little side. Yeah. But we're standing and walking in the liberty of God. We're standing in the faith of God, the favor of God, the ability of God, oh Shabbat, through his son Jesus Christ, and the little little side, yeah. Ah, more than a conqueror, and the little little side, yeah. You're more than a conqueror out there, and the little little side, yeah. You are the sons and daughters of God, oh Shabbat. Ah, you are the righteousness of God, and the little little side, yeah. Yes, you are, and the little little side, yeah. You're sitting in a space called God, and you'll have God experiences, and God will expose himself to you. Thank you, Holy Ghost. There's a mother out there praying for a son. There's a mother out there praying for a daughter. There's a father praying for a son, for his daughter. God, I pray that you would move over those parents today and strengthen them, Lord. Those that children have went astray, Lord. My God, my God, my God. Break it, break it off from under the little sire. Disrespectful under the little sire. The lying, the stealing, the killing, the things of the world, Lord. I pray right now that those children would come back to you, God. Oh, God, spare their lives under the little sire. We pray that we be snatched out of the hands of the enemy, O Shabbat. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. Thank you, Holy Ghost, O Shabbat. Not a one be lost, but all get to know you, O the Ashaya, the little see and the Osaya. Oh, God, the children be healed today. The children be set free today, Lord. The children be protected today. Thank you, God. Protected against predators under the little Osaya. Protected against the lie under the little Osaya. And the power of the lie. Oh, Shabbat. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Oh, God, do it today. And I give thy name praise. And I give thy name glory and I give thy name honor, Lord. Thy presence rests over this airway today, great Lord. And I pray that signs and wonders would follow, Lord, in the mighty name of Yeshua. That this wouldn't just be words, Lord. But as I speak, I speak at thy altar. And I pray that the people would experience thy altar, Lord. That they would all be different, O Shabbat. That they would go away and all be set free, healed, and delivered, Lord. That change will come about, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Fill this space with the atmosphere of God. And I give thy name glory. And I give thy name honor. And I give thy name praise. Hallelujah. Sata. Holy Ashobobashi. Oh, glory. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Oh, Shabbat. And the Kobosi and the other Yosaya as Shobo Babose. Glory, ah, Yobosaya. Thank you, Lord. Mm. So, won't you do it today, God? Won't this be the day, Lord, that you do it? Won't this be the day, Lord, that you move by your spirit? Let this be the day, God. Let this be the day, Lord, that you move by your spirit. Let this be the day that you bless us, Lord. That you bless us to be the blesser. Let this be the day that you move by your spirit. 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 Thank you, Holy Ghost. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, glory, hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Oh, Diasha. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, Ashova Bobosi. Glory, another Diddy Osiah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. I pray that this prayer would be sealed over your people, over your people, Father. In the mighty name of Yeshua, the Messiah, the Holy One. Amen and amen. And amen. Thank you, Lord. 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 I want to talk with you very briefly. I'm going to come back. I'm going to have a couple solos. And then I'm going to come back. 
But I want to talk to you today about it's not over, nor am I finished. I heard the Lord say, I was sitting down, I asked some individuals, I said, what do you think we should talk about today for the people? And somebody said, it's not over. Huh? Navan said, it's not over. And then I heard the Lord say, it's not over, nor am I finished. Amen. Nor am I finished, nor am I finished moving over you, nor am I finished doing what I said I would do through you. And so, listen, you stay tuned. We're going to come back with, it's not over, nor am I finished. Stay tuned. Uh, you know what? I'm going to follow the Lord. I'm going to read this scripture. I'm going to read this scripture. I'm going to read this scripture before I turn this over to them. Let me tell you something. I hear the Lord saying something. I don't know who you are. And I don't know what it is. I don't know what you're trying to do. But I'm going to tell you right now. God is moving. I hear the Lord is moving. So real quick here. Real quick here. Excuse all that. Real quick here. I want to talk to you about it's not over, nor is it finished. I heard the Lord say, it's not over, nor is it finished. Uh, there are many of you under the sound of my voice that are dealing uh, with situations and circumstances. And the individuals that have called you, uh, 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 dropped you to a place of just dead. Oh, Shabbat. Uh, you're in dead relationships. You're dead in jobs. Your business has died. Your finances have died. Everything. Your family, it seems like is just dead. Everything is just dead. There's no breath. There's no life. There's no movement in those things. And God said it's not over. No, it's a finish. Oh, Shabbat. I'm telling you right now, you, 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 they got you thinking that it's over. Oh, Shabbat. I'm reminded of a young lad. Uh, from a poor city and I'm reminded how you know in his younger days everybody thought that he was good for suicide uh -huh. they thought that, they thought that he would just die just because he was different under the little side I'm reminded you know you get to a place uh, and, and you want you want to try to make things happen that's right you get to a dry place dry place a dry area and you want to make things happen they laid you off the job things have all swelled up and emptied out and now you want to make some things happen oh Shabbat. you want to make things happen you want to you want to make it happen you I, I got to do something oh Shabbat. and you know and it seems like everything you put your hands to it dries up oh it dries up you can't move, you can't do nothing under the little seat here. No, nothing seems to work, oh Shabbat. You go to this job, to that job, and the next job. And, and uh, let me tell you something. You're having a Jonah experience, oh Shabbat. Wherever you go, oh Shabbat, uh, you don't fit in because you know God uh, didn't call you to that place. You stand out under the little side. Yeah. Uh, people know that you don't belong there. You're different under the little side. Yeah. You talk to Different. You look different, oh Shabbat. Everything about you is different under the deal, Saya. And you understand what I'm saying? And you know, I tell you, the only ones that don't see anything different, yeah, now I'm going to tell you something. You're going to meet some pharaohs, oh Shabbat. Now, the pharaohs want to make you think that you're the same. You understand? Because you may have a bow with them like Moses did. You understand what I'm saying? For a season. But you're different. I'm telling you, Saya. Your skin color is different. Your, the, way you, the way you speak is different. The way you walk. The way you chew is just different, oh Shabbat. And most of all, because you walk and you wake up with the countenance of God oh Shabbat you spend time with God before you see those people you're just different and you've come to a dry place well I got something to tell you today listen if you would just listen to this for these few minutes that dry stuff is about to come alive there is life for you this is not a death sentence oh Shabbat um, you're not walking uh, 
uh, to the chair under the Rosaya. You know, it's not the dead man walking song. You understand what I'm saying? No, this is not the death sentence. Uh, this is not the death penalty. This was this a transition to be in position. This was a transition to be put in position to fulfill the purposes and plans of God for your life. In the book of Ezekiel chapter 37, starting at verse 1. With the hand of Adonai upon me, Adonai carried me out by his spirit and sat me down in the middle of the valley. And it was full of bones. And he passed, he made me pass by all around them. And there were so many bones lying in the valley. And they were so dry. And he asked me, Human beings, can these bones live? And I answered, Adonai Elohim, only you know that. And then he said to me, prophesy over these bones and say to them, dry bones, hear what Adonai has to say. To these bones, Adonai Elohim says, I will make breathe, I will make breath into you, and you will live. I'm done to know I will attach ligaments to you, make flesh grow on you, cover you with skin, and put breath in you. You will live. And you will know that I am Adonai. And there's some of you under the sound of my voice, you're in a situation and circumstance and that thing has gotten dead and all it takes right now is just to speak to it. See, because God has put you in the valley or what I would call a space called God. You understand at the beginning of this text, God placed him somewhere. And so some of the things uh, um, that you've been placed in, everything around you, I want you to be placed in this place and I want you to look around. Every thing is dead. Oh, Shabbat. My relationships are dead. I'm done a little, Sire. My income just died. I'm done a little, Sire. Uh, my finances died. This died. Sickness. Everything's going on. It seems like everything around me is just dead. I've come to a dead end under the Osiah. It seems like everything I've done, you know, I built this building. I built this church. I built this work. And everything I built just seemed like it just died. Oh, Shabbat. And, uh, and now when it's a dead situation, Situation, oh Shabbat. Now I'm not talking about making something happen myself. But now in a dead time, in a dead situation, everything around me is dead. I'm the little Osiah. My relationships, my friendships, my fellowships, huh? Listen, let me tell you some memberships, any kind of ship, everything is just dead. Everything is sunk. You understand what I'm saying? I'm telling you right now, and those that ain't, it's just like a skunk. They stink. So everything is dead. It's got something to it it ain't right you understand what I'm talking about and so you want to know God how am I going to get out of this and you're just sitting there and you're looking around because he told you he took you to the valley and the valley was full of bones dry bones and everything was dead and then the Lord said though you know he asked him he said listen he said can these human beings live oh Shabbat. and God said and, and God said and he said uh to God, only you know that. And God began to tell him to prophesy. Now, what I need you to do today is understand one thing. Oh, Shabbat. You can't prophesy to a situation and not be in this space. Oh, Shabbat. First, you need to believe that God has placed you in the space. God has placed you around a bunch of dead things in order for you to ignite something to make it live. Oh, Shabbat. God has given you the power of the spoken word. And you got to have the ability, but you got to know where you are oh Shabbat well now the first thing is uh, I'm in a space called God or I'm in a valley I'm better than a little sire even though it's dry bones but God 
placed me here. Oh, Shabbat. God brought me to this place. I'm not, I did, this wasn't just an accident, uh, but I got here under the little side by the order of God. Oh, Shabbat. And God ordered me to walk around in this space. Uh, he wanted me to recognize that I was around a bunch of dead things. Oh, Shabbat. And dead people under the little side. And can you turn this thing around? Oh, Shabbat. And so right now, I begin to speak. Oh, Shabbat. I begin to speak to my finances. Oh, the Yasata. And I command the oh, finances. Oh, Shabbat. 